Funhouse RL by Kevin Waters. Uh, and this is one of those games where I don't even know what the necessary resolution is, so I'm just taking a big stab in the dark. Hey guys, Game Hunter here, and we're looking at another game from the 7 Day Roguelike Challenge of 2013, and already we have evil clowns and whelk shells. Evil clowns and whelk shells. Uh, oh, imagination. Uh oh. My imagination's kind of low. And we got this, oh, it's a something to pick up. I see. And do we have inventory button? Yes, we do. All right, that's cool. Do we have other buttons? The game didn't really come with anything. I guess, uh, yeah, it didn't, it didn't come with anything at all. Okay, well, that's good to know. It just, just says that? Okay, sure, why not? Sure, why not? Another evil clown with evil frowns. Food? I'd try it. Oh, boost your self-esteem. Eat. Oh, that self-esteem. Darn it. I didn't realize it was a literal stat. I needed... Oh, that's cool. So, Funhouse RL. Obviously, we got the uh, got the Funhouse theme going. That's pretty obvious. It's actually quite cool, in fact. You can, you can see the whole reflection thing doing its job, which looks completely weird in this bird's eye view, but uh, no, nevertheless, it's, it's pretty neat, so it's cool. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm wondering if it'll ever come in handy with other... Wow, that's a lot of evil clowns. A lot of evil clowns. A lot of haberdasheries. Um, I think my imagination is starting to run wild. Oh my goodness, um... Oh, apparently self-esteem is the only reason I'm alive. When you run out of self self self-esteem, you're just dead. Just plain old dead. And that's nothing else you can do about it. So there we go. So we hit level two, and that's fun. And I don't know what whelk shells are for, but nevertheless, we're gonna have to see what we can do about that. Punching more evil clowns and grabbing foods and <laughs> that that Hall of Mirrors effect is really neat. And I mean, if that's the only thing I get out of this game, well, that's still pretty great. Oh man, that's an attack. <laughs> that's an attack, huh? That's that's pretty nasty. <laughs> that's pretty nasty indeed. Okay, so we need to eat a bunch of food to make sh make sure I listen. Sure. Let's. Oh, it adds imagination. Is that my strength or something? I don't. I don't even know. But the game is it slowed down a little bit? It looked like it was. It does look like it. It has been slowing down a bit. Maybe because it's it's figuring out how to properly make everything work. Make everything work ever. So let's go ahead and increase our imagination just to get even more of it. And is there something for breath, or is breath just when you attack? You can't really attack constantly. I think that's really all the game is doing there. So. so that's something not to worry about, except in some situations. <laughs> Darn clown laughter. I guess I can avoid it. But for the most part, I can just, well, yeah. Just want to kind of avoid it. I don't know why I fought it like that. Don't ask me why. I just did. And that was all there was to it, and we'll, we will leave it at that. I don't even know what the point of leveling up is. Perhaps it's giving me more stats. More stats for the people. Oh, darn it. Okay, good. His clown laughter can't hit me from there. So you just really got to get out of the way of the clown laughter. And then you're good to go. Good to go. What happens when my imagination gets all the way up? Uh, I don't really want to use it again. There we go. Nearly full. Yeah, it doesn't really seem to be doing anything, so maybe imagination is supposed to go all the way up. That doesn't really seem to affect anything, so. Okay, well, that's fine by me. I'll just keep dilly dallying until I get to wherever the end of the game is. So, yes. And then we just keep collecting all of this stuff. It's crazy. I don't, yeah, I really don't know what the imagination is for. I was thinking it might be for attack or something, but... Oh, did I really just go downstairs again? Whoops. Oh, no. You can... Apparently there's upstairs. 
that you can go on, and I never even realized that. So there's that too. All right. So yes. Why are we trapped here again? Is it because we hate fun houses? That's probably the backstory, right? You're a kid that hates fun houses. One day your parents leave you in a fun house to fend for yourself. That sounds like a perfect plot device. And we can eat lots of food. I mean, does this ever have an end? I guess it should because it's still got upstairs that you can have memory that goes back to. So we can keep playing this for a bit longer, that's for sure. But other than that, we don't really seem to have any other mechanics in the game. It's just this is this is the game pretty much. So I mean, it's not it's not bad. It's just uh lacking more content. I do like the laugh thing. That's neat. It's creative. <clears throat> it just uh ends up not being that big of a deal to, to deal with so yes and I guess I have to get my breath back I'm actually kind of low on breath so we're just gonna go ahead and sit around and pace and get our breath back so it is something to worry about just oh darn it the darn clown laughs the evil darn clown laughs okay that's good enough get even more of those yeah, I don't know. Maybe I have like an ability to do. Let's try some more buttons. Imagination has to do something. And uh, you know, I'm, I've spent enough time. Darn it! Double darn it! Got to get away from that clown laugh. There we go. Okay, let's just try some buttons. Okay, so we got Hajikable Yubin in this game, and I just pressed the quick find button. Um, and we also have WASD, but I'm not really getting other buttons here, so I don't know darn, what imagination could be used for. It, I really hope it has some use, but I just can't find it. Literally cannot. Oh well, let's go eat some more food. Nom 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 nom. To build up that self-esteem, we eat food. I mean, we're fat. Well, I guess it doesn't mean we're fat, but it means that food is one of our comforts in life. Man, that, that infinite pool is cool. The infinite pool is cool. Get away from that evil clown laugh and then do stuff. I mean, is this going to end? What floor am I even on? The game does not tell me. So I thought, I thought I'd do it after a certain point, but I don't even know when, when we're done, so... That is another issue that I have to worry about. Oh, my self-esteem. Need more self-esteem. Okay, here we go. Fighting lots of clowns this time. Oh my goodness. Um, yes. Well, at least he stopped. Thank goodness. That clown couldn't hold his breath long enough, I guess. Okay, and then we just move on to the next one. I don't even, I really don't even know what to say for the rest of this game, though. That's the problem. We got a lot of clowns this time. Oh, crap, my breath. I'm out of breath. I'm out of breath, darn. Like a potato salad. I'm still out of breath. Can I, nope. Well, we'll just have to eat some food. Which doesn't give me breath back, by the way. But now we just gotta do some spam to get my breath back. So I get breath and it actually turned out to be important. Go figure. It's just uh, not absolutely hard to... Whoa, that's a lot of clowns. Send in the clowns. We have an emergency. The emergency is rice pudding. Okay, let's see. Just get a few of those. Maybe some breath attacks. Oh. Game's being kind of slow sometimes when I do that in big areas. Let's see, but it eventually catches up, as notified in this particular instance. And once again, we descend and fight more clowns. Ah, evil clowns that are suffocated by their own laughter. Oh, what irony befell upon thou. Need to get my breath back. These clowns are not letting me get my breath back. 
Well, I guess now it's it's become important, and yeah, I'm about dead. Oh, then I died because I pushed the wrong button. Well, I think we'll leave it at that because that's all the mechanics, and I just wanted to see if there was more, but we didn't get to more. There might be, but you'll have to get through the gauntlet first. Anyway, yeah, I, I do like the theme. I do like the one enemy type. There could stand to be several more and maybe something to use for imagination. I couldn't find the button that's supposed to use imagination, but that doesn't mean there isn't one. So, yes indeed. Oh. <sighs> okay, well I have an inventory, but okay, well, okay, yeah, that means that, and there's this, there's sprinting. Um, yes, it says escape's supposed to work, but I guess I'll just refresh. So you can hold, oh, so, all right, so you can run in this game if you want, but that also takes breath. Okay, so that's cool, that's cool. <laughs> Neat. Doesn't seem like imagination helps. Oh, um, yeah, you glance at yourself in the mirror. Well, yeah, I don't know what imagination's for, I guess I don't. If anybody wants to let me know, just like, favor, subscribe if you figure out what imagination does. Anyway, this has been Game Hunter playing Funhouse the Rogueliker RL. Join me next time when we take a look at another game from the 7 day roguelike challenge of 2013. Until then, keep playing those roguelikes guys, and take care.